present a novel acoustic-based method that utilizes the human body as a communication channel to propagate information across different devices. It is a well-known physical phenomenon that acoustical signals can be propagated through air, solid, and liquid objects with different characteristics. The human body is composed of a mixture of materials including bone, water, and muscle. Characterizing the propagation of the acoustical signals through the body would introduce opportunities for personal area networks and natural human-computer interaction. As more wearable computers come to the market, a user may wear different wearable devices such as Google Glass and smartwatches. They use wireless technology to communicate with each other such as Bluetooth. However, to set up the communication, a user has to go through a tedious pairing process. By using the body as the medium for communication, both devices can automatically complete the authentication process. For example, if the devices are connected to the same body, then they can communicate with each other. Otherwise, no such transmission occurs. Our technology can also be used for transmitting information between two persons. Instead of exchanging business cards, with our technology, the personal information can be exchanged naturally between their watches when they perform handshaking. Our method also can be applied to the transmission of information between users and the environment. By touching objects in the environment, a user can transmit personal information to relevant objects, for example, a door handle, for authentication instead of using keys. The environment can also send necessary information back. The common ways to get information are either to read through the long text in the crowd, or scan a QR code which requires the effort to position the camera and take pictures. With our technology, the whole exhibit board can be encoded with information acoustically. Therefore, by simply touching the objects in the environment, the information will flow to the wearable devices on the body. In the next part, we demonstrate transmitting text information within the same body, between two bodies, and between the body and the environment. We input text on one laptop, which is then transformed to the bitstream by using Morse code. The bitstream is then sent to the modulation circuit, which eventually is sent to the bone transducer. The other laptop is used for receiving the bitstream from the demodulation circuit and decoding the stream into text with Morse code. We demonstrate the communication with the same body by attaching the sender on the wrist and the receiver on the upper arm. The text can be exchanged across two persons by handshaking. We successfully transmit the text information from the chair to the body when the hand touches the chair. The text information can also be transmitted from the body to the door handle. When the hand is off the handle, the information cannot be transmitted. Even the vibration motor on a Sony smartwatch is able to transmit information from the body to the door handle. When the hand is off the handle, the information cannot be transmitted.